Greetings, viewers, and welcome back. Starting right back where we left off. I think I'm smelling myself a little bit, as they say in some circles. Um, kind of happy with the uh, the base and the little turret operations we've got set up. Um, just probably need to get some more concrete all around, and I don't think that there's much else we can do before the next horde, which we have plenty of time for. But one thing that I do want to do is I want to hit up that uh, big Shamway place that we went to a previous episode and I said I'd like to come back there it's kind of a little bit bigger POI I've never actually been there and I feel like it's probably going to have some good loot and hopefully some upgrades for us so without further ado I, uh, I've already got all my stuff put away and we're just going to jump in the truck and head right over there got distracted by a little bit of iron here we're definitely going to want uh, as much steel as possible so I'm going to hit up every uh, little bit of iron I can find and what do you know, as I'm out here mining some iron, a uh, airdrop just came in, and there's our house, and it's right there on top of the mountain in front of it, so we'll definitely be trying to get that. All right, and here we are. There's a couple uh, cars in the parking lot. I'm going to go ahead and hit those up real quick and take them apart, put this brand new ratchet to use. Once we take care of our uh, friends here. Alright, so I'm going to take care of these cars. Let's see uh, how this ratchet does with maxed out salvage operations. bad. So I've been trying to kind of save you guys from the boring harvesting of cobblestone, stone, other things. One of the things uh, I'm just... It's just something I'm trying to do to kind of conserve time so you guys are getting a little bit more of the action. Hopefully I can uh, squeeze some more time in some of the episodes. So I'm actually going to go ahead and clear out this entire parking lot. I'm going to chop that wood, harvest that cobblestone and cement. I'm going to pick up these uh, every one of these shopping carts. may tower up and grab these uh, street lights as well for the steel. I'm just going to... I'm just going to tear this whole entire place apart as we go through here, and I'm just going to salvage and scrap everything I possibly can. I'd like to upgrade the base to concrete as much as possible and then also get steel so the more clay and iron we have to uh, provide to that cause, the better off we'll be. All right, so as stated, I took down every single street light, all the cars in the parking lot, shopping carts, trash cans, uh, anything that I was able to disassemble and get parts out of. As you can see, we got a uh, nice chunk of steel here. I was getting about three to four per street light, so that's pretty nice. I'm going to go ahead and stick all this crap in the 4x4, and it looks like that's where we need to enter from. So we'll go ahead and get we'll pull forward and uh, get this POI started. We're just back into the loading dock here in case we need to uh, bail out of here in a hurry. We already got some friends spawning. Still getting used to this crossbow. The fact that you have to hit the fire button to load the next bolt in just makes me feel like I'm going to send a bolt off somewhere I don't want it to be. He's on fire! I'm going to go ahead and clear. What I think I'll do is I'll just clear out these rooms. Well whatever rooms there are. So for example, the room that we're in, what I'll start doing is I'll just clear this out of zombies, make sure it's safe, and then I'm gonna go ahead and grab all the uh, the resources again. So I can just kind of save you guys having to watch me hit stuff with a shovel or an ax 400 different times, even, even cutting out the uh, middle portions of it still I'm sure gets tedious watching it. All right, not much going on in here. A crate. That's always good. Uh oh. Somebody. Oh, hello, buddy. Ah, that was smart. 
They make you think there's not going to be somebody in there because there's not enough space. Then they hit you with the half zombie. Looks like it, so I'm gonna go ahead and round up this cobblestone. Looks like it opens up into the store. Looks like uh, the earth opened up under the store. Let's go ahead and uh, deposit the stuff in the truck first before pushing forward since I fill up on loot fast. This looks like there would be something under here. All right, let's see what we can find in here. Definitely not bashing through that. A harrow. Uh, goodbye. Crushed sand. Making all the concrete. Any visible sleeping zombies anywhere here? Clearly they don't want us to go that way. Is that a zombie or a dead body? That's a dead body. E. See something back there behind the cooler. What is this? Is this a secret room? <gasps> There's a crate back there. Hey, bet that up. Bet you I can take this apart. Oh. They don't sound happy about me finding their loot. The Morty twins and Mo. And they're all one hitter quitters. They talk a big game. Hey, th this is the other side of that door we uh <laughs> That's a locked chest. Is this the main stash? Hidden Yeah, there's a button right there to get back out to the exit. Holy shit. <laughs> uh okay. Um well, now that we know this is here, let's go through the POI the right way. I'll go ahead and take apart the rest of these coolers. And uh, push on. We can figure out where the next area is. Oh, and we woke up somebody in the loot room. Some buddies. Stay down, buddy. Wow. Okay, well. something breaking mm, let's see what we got let's uh well since this door goes right back out let's open it uh we can hit up some of this loot all right so i got all the cobblestone and basic stuff here i didn't I'm not going to get any of that bean loot. What I'll do is I'll just run through the uh, POI the way it's supposed to be done, and then we'll come upon it and loot it then. Um, go ahead and top up our belly and then top off in the truck again just to make more room. They're definitely outside here beating on this wall. I probably should take care of that before they find their way in and end up pincering me. Of course it would be you two. All 
All right, back to business again. It's almost nighttime, and we started the game at 10 a.m. Shit, at this rate. Uh, we may actually just grab the loot, load up the truck, and then we'll start pushing the POI just to see what we can get out of it. That way, if uh, things get hairy, at least we've already got loot loaded up. If I ever use the electric timer relay, regular relays are fine. You just sell it. Really didn't want to let me in for that, huh? Can't put another grip mod on the thing, huh? Alright, not, uh, not exactly stellar loot, but I guess it's more loot than we had. Maybe there's some more better stuff inside. Try to hide some stuff. I am going to take this chest apart, though. Hey, what do you know we're encumbered, but we did get a good bit of stuff out of that. Let's go put it back in the truck. All right. I'm going to leave that there just so I don't get confused on my uh, path that I'm supposed to take. Unless somebody want us to go around here. Oh, fat boy. Go, 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 go. Oh, he's mad. Oh, he's mad. Oh, what is this? Reload. Can we get some... Like, what? what is happening? Why are we not hitting anything? Okay. Uh, wow. Yeah. That was pretty scary. Down to 74 to 135 health from that. And they're not even moving fast. I don't know what that was all about. I'm glad we got this bump shotgun. There's no way we would have survived that with a uh, double barrel or a pipe. I guess we could have switched to the AK. Still somebody shuffling around and punching stuff. Sounds like a lot of zombies. Oh, I just saw somebody outside running around too. Let's, uh, let's keep the AK handy, huh? Sleeping lizard ain't even making any noise. Why does it feel like they're in here invisible? Where are they all at? This doesn't sound fun at all. Is there a way to get up here? Let's just uh, grab some loot while they do whatever it is they're doing, shall we? Looks like there's a portion of the store that goes back there, maybe on the other side of this wall. Are you guys in the deli? Okay. They're outside the store. 
Huh. Must be a... Well, that looks like that's part of the POI there. Never let them know your next move. Which is probably run back to where you came from. What was that, buddy? He's dead. They're dead. All right. And now they're coming in from the front. And of course they, uh, there we go. All right, well, say we're okay here for now. The AK handy. We got a full mag plus 69 bullets left. Yeah. Convenient. All right, where are you guys at? There's no way to get back up to the truck, is there? I'd have to put a block down. Um... I left all my frames. Let's uh, give ourselves a bridge to retreat. Oops. Just in case. Oh, there we go. We got some friends. Hey, friend. There's still a bunch of them out there. Sounds like they've got the whole building surrounded. There's one. She doesn't seem to know where I am. Oops. Now she does. All right, level up, level up. Man, they are not happy that I'm in this store. There's a big opening they've made to let themselves in. There's a fat boy out there. Well, just don't want to get surrounded. Back up, Terry. Yep. It's a little too many to take on at one time. Mama didn't raise no fool, as they say. Right, I know you guys know how to jump up here. Okay. I feel like this is a part of a mini horde that came in from outside. I don't think all these zombies are part of this POI, especially with how many came from outside. Still got more out there punching stuff. Got the epic music going. They're definitely giving me a run for my money. We're going to fall out of the ceiling. This vending machine doesn't work. Go ahead and crawl in there, buddy. 
Some nasty knees. Get them things looked at. I'm not even sure where we're supposed to be going here. I want to go check out this uh, place where they all came from. Ooh, Mega Crush. Stamina regen and run speed. We may be needing that. Oh, we don't need that. Hello? Not sure if you guys have watched my uh, video on scrapping versus straight up smelting stuff. I know I had mentioned it in a previous video, but I didn't know exactly all the uh, ins and outs of it. But I did a uh, video of it, and a lot of the things, if you uh, put them in the forge, you, you get a decent amount back instead of uh, losing some by scrapping it. So I'm going to do my best to try and hold on to things and just straight up throw them in there. But a couple springs or pipes here and there, I may just uh, say forget it. It's not worth the... Uh, Losing the space over. I'm going to get rid of this rotten flesh. But so, for example, these cans, if I scrap these, they'll give me three iron each. But if I throw them in the forge, they'll give me five. So one or two cans here and there, not a big deal. But once you get up into the higher numbers, you're, you're kind of losing out a little bit. Or Mega Crush. I may just drink one of those now since we have so many. Oh, we have a break or a sprain. A sprained leg. Mild infection? What? Well, I guess probably so after getting punched so many times. Alright, infection's taken care of. Painkiller. Can't really do much else for it. At least if we get a broken leg, we have a cast to fix it. It still says 2.6. You want us to go up here? Hey, look at that. Pretty sure those white tiles collapse just like every other drop ceiling in this game. Oh wow. Epic loot. So what are we supposed to do now? Right back in the store. This was not here when we got here. Was there another route to take up there? That was it, right? All this is just this area. So they just hit a crate in the ceiling and probably some zombies to pop out. So Okay. Hey, you replace the honey we just used. Let's take a vitamin. Keep carrying them around and not ever using them. Let's top our health off with the aloe. No, wait, we can't. We're at 106 out of 136. We've got the uh, sprained leg. That's right, it reduces our maximum health. 
Look at that, we're learning. Too bad we can't crawl through there like the zombies can. Can we break this? Maybe those coolers let us back there? They're already out there punching stuff. Yeah. Let's see a way to get. Oh, can we get up there? Hmm. This was only twelve hundred. Let's see what's back here. I'm being nosy now. I want to just break stuff. I don't know where the hell that was. Ah, so these plants I've discovered, if you put them straight in a forge, you get a significant amount of uh, clay versus scrapping them. So I will not be scrapping these plants anymore. They will all be going straight into the forge. How are you going to put a zombie in a locked room? That's Dwayne the Rock zombie right there. You don't lock him in a room. Nobody puts the rock in a corner. How are you supposed to get back here? Torches here. The hell? Was back here the what landmine back here that I completely missed or something? Why is everything damaged? This is back. Okay, I guess you're supposed to come from there. So how do you get back here? You guys are probably screaming at your screen right now, yelling at me that I'm an idiot and I missed something. I didn't see anything down in the hole except a whole bunch of burned up zombies. Good. More looky loos. You're supposed to go. There's a torch up there. It's over here. Zombies sleeping on top of a vending machine. That's new. Oh, there's one in the wall there. Oh, jeez. I was expecting to bust out in one hit. Let's uh, thin their numbers a little bit. Hey, it's Big Mama, of course. They love hiding her in walls, huh? Dropped her in one hit, and she gave us a blue loot bag. Very nice. I like. All right, these aren't that big of a return. There's only a couple. Let's see what she gave us. What's that? A hazmat jacket. I've never seen that before. Huh. Cool. Uh, but we can't fit it. 
It seems like that'd be good to sell. Um, duct tape. Let's just do that. Little employee lounge area. Oh, there's some stairs. Hey, an ATM. Uh, somebody's walking around. Oh, that's a uh, big nasty dude, isn't it? He's big nasty. Oh, no mo. That first shot was a fluke. Oh, that was a, a leaper. I know they're called spiders. I like calling them leaping lizards. Zombie, or the rock zombie found his way in. Okay. Pay no attention to the man behind the curtain. Really? What's happening here? All right. Let's uh, offload again. What are you doing? You're obnoxious, kid. Wow, I like this Mega Crush speed. Holy shit. Yeah, need race car sound effects. All right. We've already screwed this up, so let's get this. Oh. Shit. Oh. Glad that didn't break my leg. I can grab some coal down here. See, there's nothing down here. There's no tunnels. Be nice if we get a bacon and eggs recipe from a grocery store. Backpack down here. Whoopee. is all coal. I'm going to need this coal for making uh, gunpowder now and running fuel in my crafting stations. But you know what? We uh, we have the book. Art of mining. Harvest 10% more than bonus when cof from coffee. So let's try and find some coffee and then come back down here and get this coal. I think that sounds like a sound strategy to get more out of it. That seems to be a pretty big deposit. Fuck you, doggy. I don't know where you came from. That? Where the hell did that dog come from? He just like spawned there? Or did he? Oh, he must have busted out from up there, I'm guessing. 
least he let us know he was there. I <laughs> tried to get the AK out. All right. There, okay, there's a lantern. There's a torch. So somehow we got to, like, frogger our way over there. Or you're supposed to, I guess. Not like I am doing this POI in any sort of logical fashion whatsoever. Uh, I don't think we're going to reach. No. Okay, guess we're going from over there. Oh, you know what? There were stairs over here we never even looked at. Wow, I'm just messing this all up. Hey, there's coffee. Oh, we put our coin in the fucking car. Damn it. Hey, what's up, chicken? Too lazy to get my knife out. outside anybody not awake in this building yet oh yep there's that clown that's loaded oh not today tubby no thank you There's coffee for free. Hey, a gun safe in the middle of here. Hey, all right. Uh, let's close this door. And break into it and then take it apart. All right, we got it unlocked. Um, <laughs> we should run back to the vehicle and offload. I'm going to grab that coin. I'm going to grab this eye candy. Um... And distract it again. And I am over the place in this POI. I feel like a kid in the toy section of Walmart that just got 20 bucks for his birthday and I'm just all over the place. Don't know what I want to do. Hey, first try. I right, can't even loot that. Let's uh, scrap the chairs. Let's go ahead and offload. All right, let's take this thing apart for the steel. All right. Let's get this eye candy. And we already looted the main stash. I don't know how much more there's going to be in this place. I guess if we move quick, maybe, and we find something else, it'll still be active. Ah, damn it, I didn't... All right, there is no hope for me, folks. Just move along. <laughs> I just talked about it. Uh, okay, sure. This is level six pistols, nice. We upgraded to the Magnum. I want to conserve our nine mil ammo for those turrets. Start crafting some too, because we didn't have full stacks. Trying to remember to use this eye candy is going to be like trying to remember to put on the uh, stupid loot goggles. Okay, we're on the roof. So there's probably going to be birds up here. Probably going to be zombies hiding in there. Hey, wake up. Maybe. No? They all dropped down on us already, I guess. There's a body. We've got a good vantage point down into the store from up here. box um trying to maintain the high ground because i have no idea where they're going to be popping out of probably those
If you run up on the loot box thinking you're going to get a free score, and then they just pop out on you. I bet you they haven't spawned yet. Let's make sure we're loaded up. Everything is topped off. Seen any birds? Where's this hatch go? That's where we came up, dum dum. I haven't seen any birds. Or zombies, so I know they're hiding up here. Door doesn't have a light on, but is it open? Oh, yes, it is on. There are no zombies up here. They they gotta all be hiding in that. There we go. And of course lumberjack. Let's try out this forty four Magnum. Ooh, he didn't like that, but he's still alive. Shut up. I'm trying to sound like a damn T Rex. Hit. You're the only one guarding the loot. It's probably a waste, but I'm going to just use it. Since I didn't earlier. Come on. Something good. Really? I said something good. Well, maybe there's more loot. How greedy can I be? How many is that? Four. He was feral. Slow down, buddy. It's not a race. Well, maybe for you it is. Definitely need clay. And stone. Um... Get rid of our. Oh, no, there's glue. Get rid of two items for one. I know I can mine stone, but as slow as my guy mines everything, I'll take what I can get for free as well. I guess that's how they expect you to get back down, maybe? Because there's no way you're going to jump that. Cornmeal. I'm just hopeful that I can find a recipe sometime. Oh, this is how we get in the ceiling. There's a flashlight. I guess this is how we're supposed to do it. I don't know how you're supposed to get up here. Oh, oh, the stairs that we took. Duh. The hatch out onto the roof. Then you drop into this. Okay, I see. And then this would drop into that pharmacy area to go to the loot. Got it. I can figure things out. I can also screw them up royally and do a POI all ass backwards and take a whole day to do it. Let's see. Perma dead body. 
That's a uh, live body. Sort of. Undead body, right? See, there's the pharmacy down there. Okay, okay, I see what we're supposed to have done here. Yeah, yeah. Forgive me for being inquisitive and finding the main stash right off the bat. Alright, alright. Let's get the hell out of here. We still have an airdrop to collect. We've got a mission. We've got a vehicle full of loot. Ah, fuck, we've got the coal down there. I definitely want to grab that coal, so I'm going to save you guys the uh, trouble of watching that. Just going to offload everything into the vehicle, drink some coffee, grab as much coal as possible, and then, uh, let's see, what's closer? The airdrop before the quest, so we could probably head to the house, grab the airdrop, go that way, go back to the trader. Sounds like a plan. Alright, so I did as much damage as I could in here. Got a uh, 600 coal, 223 stone. That's definitely going to be helpful in crafting some gunpowder as long as we have the nitrate uh, powder to go with it. So let's uh, jump in the buggy and head back towards the house and the airdrop. Alright, so we made it back to the old homestead. And uh, our airdrop is on that mountain somewhere. I don't know if it's on this side. But that's it right there. Uh, that's gonna be a little precarious to get to. I don't know if we're gonna be able to jump to it. Let's uh, <laughs> let's find out. I'm gonna go ahead and put all this loot away, just so you guys can see what's here, and then I'm gonna just put it all in its respective containers inside, and then just leave all the stuff I'm gonna vendor inside the vehicle. So I'm gonna get that done real fast. All right, while I'm putting loot away, I'm gonna go ahead. Uh, we have 937 concrete waiting on us. I'm gonna make 517 more while I'm uh, loading everything in the containers. Oh. Got a mini mini horde coming on the house here. Let's pull them away from the house so they don't break all my stuff. It would be kind of fun to uh, test out the base, but I don't want to waste all the ammo in the turrets on these clowns. Be a couple rounds short on horde night, and I'll be wishing I hadn't done that. Not a bad little six-shooter there. All right, so when I was editing the footage from uh, when I was on the roof or doing repairs and I jumped off and hurt my leg, I noticed that there was an ammo pile on top of that AC unit. I'm not really sure how they expect you to get that without doing this. So this is how I'm going to get up there. Totally worth All right, so now our uh, we're gonna have to try and figure out how to get that eardrop. That's a terrible spot for it. I may be needing these frames to use as steps. Or we'll just uh, Skyrim our way up here and just keep spamming jump. All right, that wasn't too bad. I just had to keep spamming jump. All right, what do we get? Wrench, which will sell soup, baked potato, and cornbread. Okay. All right, so we'll load that up to sell. I'm going to put this food stuff away. 
And uh, I think we're going to have to call it for this episode. I've reached my time limit on recording. However, I'm going to pick it up right back here where we leave off, and uh, we'll get started with the next episode. So if you've been sticking around since the beginning, I appreciate you watching. If you're just tuning in, hopefully you're enjoying what you're seeing so far. Feel free to leave a like, comment down below. Let me know anything that you like or don't like about the series so far, anything you'd like to see moving forward. I will uh, appreciate any constructive criticism you guys have to give. So thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.